Welcome to the first part of our trip to Milan Cathedral, Duomo di Milano, in Italy. It's the Cathedral Church of Milan in Lombardy, Northern Italy, dedicated to Santa Maria Necente, St. Mary Nessant. It is the seat of the Archbishop of Milan, currently Cardinal Dionigi Tatamanzi. The Gothic Cathedral took nearly six centuries to be completed. It is the fourth largest cathedral in the world, as it is set in the center of the city. The street plan of Milan indicates that the Duomo occupied the most important site in the ancient Roman city, Mediolanum. St. Ambrose built a new basilica on this site at the beginning of the 5th century, with an adjoining basilica added in 836, when fire damaged both buildings in 1075, they were rebuilt as the Duomo. In 1386, the Archbishop Antonio da Saluzzo began the new project in Rionan late Gothic style that is more characteristic of France than Italy. Gothic construction on the rest of the Domo was largely completed in the 1880s. The Duomo was recently under major renovations and cleaning for several years. Of securing the west front with scaffolding, works were finally completed in 2009, revealing the newly cleaned facade in all its glory. The Duomo of Milan blurs the distinction between Gothic and Neo-Gothic, for the Gothic West Front was begun in 1660 and completed 200 years later. From 1900, some of the less Gothic details of the Ficade were replaced in a true Gothic style, two designs of Giuseppe Brentano. The roof line dissolves into open work panicles that are punctuated by a groove of spires, topped with statues that overlook the city. The main spire is 109 meters high, as it was topped in 1762 with a polychrome statue of the Madonna, to whom the Duomo and its predecessor have always been dedicated. This can all be investigated up close on a breathtaking walk on the roof. The terraces on the roof of the cathedral are constructed of Candoglia marble from Maggiore Lake. It's presented a unique innovation in the construction of the cathedral roofs. Milan's cathedral has recently developed a new lightning system based on LED lights. 